and welcome to Exchange for Media. With me today is recently appointed CEO of VMLYNR India, Mr. Saurabh Saxena. Saurabh, hi, welcome to Exchange for Media. Thank you so much, Nazia. Lovely to be here. Saurabh, thanks for this first interview ever since you've been appointed as the new CEO of this newly uh, integrated agency. I mean, agency has been old, but their integration has just taken place a couple of years ago. So, you know, I wanted to understand from you, uh, the agency got finally integrated in 2018-19 and you joined it in 2022. Considering that the company doesn't have a very long legacy in India, how do you plan to take things forward? Okay. So, first off, let me tell you that while uh, VML, YNR in this current avatar is, is new and young, the legacy of these individual brands is, is long and, and uh, very admirable, I would say. So VML, YNR Commerce has been in various forms, has been alive uh, within WPP for many, many years. And this is the team that has built capabilities into shopper and rural activation and urban activation and, and the likes. Uh, the glitch, which is a uh, Julian Akron, has been around for a really long time as well. And that, uh, you know, you know, if you do, of course, I'm sure no more, Nazia, that uh, uh, the glitch is a very successful agency. So while as a brand, we may not have that much of legacy, but the constituents have legacy. GTB, which is uh, Ford. Really. And that's what I said. After yeah. integration, uh, how do you want to take it forward? So uh, to combine our strengths, really, that's the short answer. Let me explain what I mean. There are... Uh, uh, so the way that we'd like to grow is not necessarily through only social media or to do, you know, one little project in uh, rural India, for instance. We'd like to grow on in scale. And to be able to do that, we need capabilities right through the line, whether it is customer experience or uh, brand experience or, you know, D2C, shopper, uh, commerce, offline commerce, rural activation. So therefore, we have, what we are doing is we are taking all of these capabilities and putting them together to create connected brand experiences for businesses that we work on. Now, uh, a lot of our clients may not require the entire suite of our services, but they may require more than one. They may require three, they may require two. So uh, that's really what, how we are restructuring ourselves. We are making sure that we have the right cast and crew to address any marketing problem or an opportunity that our clients would like to address. Saurabh, uh, you also have this expectations that you, you your agency did exceedingly well at Cannes last year and uh, you after the integration you know you're relatively new and yet I think you won more than four medals last year at Cannes yeah we were, we were very successful yes yeah so uh, what are your plans this year so uh, I, I wish I could tell you more but I can tell you that the global creative council of VML Weiner is very happy with the entries that, that we have, with all the work that has happened in the last uh, many months, led by Mukund, who's our chief creative officer. I'm sure you know him, know of him, and know him as a, as a superstar. So, uh, you know, there, there is a lot of promise. Fingers crossed. I can't tell you what those uh, are just yet, but I can tell you that we are looking at it with uh, great expectation and great anticipation. We wish you all the best and do make us proud again this year. Oh, yes, yes, Nazia, we, we'd, we'd, we'd love to be, uh, you know, uh, beat our own uh, past year record. record. Uh, sort of, there also has been a lot of restructuring within uh, the, the agency, you know, after right. you took over. Uh, how has this restructuring helped the agency? Okay, so like I said, the first thing is the fact that we are now casting for, uh, casting a crew specific to a business solution that a client might require. Uh, and that means that we have we don't have a social media silo. We don't necessarily have a silo which is doing only BX. We have an account management team or, a, or even a creative team that is pretty much uh, sort of integrated already. So each team has capabilities within to take care of what the requirement of the lead clients are, are going to be. The other thing we are doing is trying to build through restructuring, trying, trying to build diversity. So as an agency, we are 57, 43 uh, in terms of our diversity ratio, which we are happy about. There is a lot more that obviously has to be done, even though this number sounds very, very good. Uh, but aside of that, uh, I think there is diversity in terms of how, uh, what backgrounds are people come from, the, their socioeconomic background, their exposure, their uh, 
uh, how they've grown up, where the, the background that uh, that they have, and the kind of education that they bring to the table. And I think that will give us uh, even more inclusivity and and diversity to to be able to have a diversity of ideas. Uh, as an agency, Nazia, I have to say that we'd like to strive to be a very solutions oriented company and not just you know a campaign here or a uh, you know big idea communication there but it could be anything the the uh, if we, there is a marketing problem the response to that need not be a campaign it could be launch of a d2c platform for instance so that's what we are hoping to achieve and this restructure should be able to help us uh, do that we are already seeing directionally some improvement in terms of how our teams are working together well on our top businesses. So yeah, fingers crossed again, there is, uh, there's more where this came from. So last year, you and Jimitri joined forces to launch VMLY and our commerce encompass, an end-to-end -end creative commerce company. How has yeah. that uh, benefited the clients, you know, or the company? What kind of response are you getting? Okay, so for instance, uh, our... Uh, the, I talked about lineage and you know this uh, our team which is led by Shankar when it comes to our our some of our commerce capabilities Shankar has worked for years on let's say Unilever I'm taking an example okay so the resident knowledge that his team and him have about Unilever products and uh, across the, 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 the spectrum has carried on the brand name has changed uh, also, what we have done is VML and our commerce is a far bigger entity now. We are perhaps one of the very, very few agencies that have offline commerce capabilities right up to online commerce capabilities. So, Karthik, who heads our uh, our, our uh, e-commerce uh, part of the business and partners, Shankar, comes with the uh, experience in D2C, in, uh, in creating marketplaces and creating demand generation uh, work, technology and solutions. And uh, so therefore, as VML YNR Commerce, we have offline to online, the short answer, offline to online capabilities, as well as uh, be able to do anything. Uh, for instance, if you look at uh, rural activation, if you look at uh, demand generation on the ground, if you look at behavior change that we'd like to do, this is the team that can actually deliver and is delivering across various clients. So, you know, before I uh, sum it up, uh, if you could tell me, some five or four or five things that make you different from your competition in the market, what would they be? Okay, so uh, right on, on top, I think is the fact that we'd like to believe that we are very, uh, we are a connected team that works on connected brands. So connected brand experiences are important when it comes to, you know, consumers don't necessarily look at one part of the puzzle and, and think of something that they, they'd like a, a connected brand experience. I think that makes us different. That's something that VML YNR has in its uh, DNA. Aside of that, people, I am new to this role, but I know that uh, you know the capability in the leadership team is immense. And that's what is something that we only have to bring together and harness and take to the next level. Uh, the, uh, the other thing I would say is that uh, uh, our creative teams, uh, led by Mukul uh, and Arpan and Shunetra and Raj, are uh, not necessarily only thinking about campaigns. So, you know, there are many agencies that think of what is the big idea in communication. We'd like to think of big ideas when it comes to a solution that may be required, like I said. I think that's what is uh, exciting us quite a lot. The last thing I would say is that we are a very connected network ourselves. So, you know, within Asia Pacific, we were in, uh, in, in Thailand last week and uh, this was really my first time interacting with the regional leadership. And I realized that, uh, you know, there are solutions that a Malaysia team might have thought of or uh, our team in Singapore might have thought of, which are relevant here. So we don't re necessarily re need to reinvent uh, the wheel. At the same time, there are solutions that our team in India has worked on, which may be very, very possible to, to lift and shift to other markets. So I think as a network, because we are so well connected, we can benefit and, you know, hasten our learning curve. Uh, to offer solutions to clients. Thank you so much, Saurabh, for talking to us. We wish you all the best for Khans and also for, you know, your journey ahead. Thank you. Thank you so much, Nazir. It's been an absolute pleasure. Thanks.